Hello, this is Alfred with Crest LLC. I am an Xactimate certified trainer, so you know you're getting trained properly and correctly with Crest LLC. In this video, we're going to talk about the undo button, or some people call it the back button, I guess. But And you can see if you hover over it right there, the shortcut is Control Z. This is a great shortcut. Control Z button, or the back button, or undo button, there's two things about it you should really keep in mind. One is that it will go back five steps. So if I put... Let's say I put six rooms here. You'll notice if I hit Control-Z, or I'll just come up here and click since uh, Control-Z, you can't really see me do it on the keyboard. I'm going to click on it. There's one, there's two, there's three, there's four, there's five. And if I click on it again, you'll notice this room doesn't disappear. That's because, like I said, it only goes back five steps. So the moral of the story is don't screw it up past five steps. Otherwise, you're going to have to resketch it because there is no forward button like in Word and Excel. So that's one of the things that you want to consider. The other thing that you want to consider is it only goes back when it's officially a step. And I'll show you what I mean. by. If I take this room here, for example, let me zoom in some here. And let's say that I break and I create an offset right down here. Now let's say I hit the break key again and I break it right there. Okay. Uh, I have not officially created an action until I move one of those two handles. So what happens is, and, and a lot of people make this mistake. Let's say they break it in the wrong place. They really meant to break it over here. They use the back button. And what happens is since neither one of these has officially been moved, when you hit the back button, watch what happens. It actually undoes the step before that. It goes back to the last official step. So watch here when I click on the back button, what's going to happen is instead of it undoing the, the, uh, the break, it undoes this section here. I see that a lot in my class. So if you break something where you didn't really mean to, like if I broke it here and I really meant to break it over here, instead of hitting the back button, just hit the break key again and it resets the break. That way it doesn't mess up your drawing. So that's the end of this video. We will see you at the next video. Well, that's the end of the video. If you like this video, give it the old thumbs up. I think it's down here somewhere. Or even better, subscribe so that you get to see any of the future videos that I post on here. Have a great day. We'll see you at the next video.